What's up, beautiful people? My name's Al, and welcome to my YouTube channel. On today's video, I got a super awesome one and the perfect yard for us to get into, but we have to hurry up and get there because the sun is rising and I don't have much time. I'm literally in a time crunch. I have to get this video out today. It rained all week. We have a hurricane coming, so I gotta mow this yard today, edit up this video, and schedule it out. So let's make this intro pretty short and sweet, but I wanted to tell you guys, last week's video, I've been getting a lot of comments saying that me and Charles didn't look that sketchy, but to be honest, all you guys see is us mowing the yard. We're at the yard for about 10 minutes prior to even starting mowing. We're looking around the yard, getting before shots, and maybe the homeowner saw us doing that and thought we were sketchy. I don't know. I just wanted to clear that up. I seen she was getting a little bit of hate and I don't like when people hate. So I just want to let you guys know that. But let's go ahead and get into this yard right here. I drove up to this yard yesterday and literally right when I got there, it was raining. It started to even flood. It was like a monsoon. The grass on this yard is super, super, super thick and it's really nice grass. This might be one of my best transformations ever because usually when I'm doing yards, it's super tall, nasty grass. This is actually really good grass. So I'm excited to see how it turns out. Just like usual, we got vines growing up the sides of the house. We got a super overgrown sidewalk, super overgrown driveway, and a super overgrown back patio that you know I love to edge up, get the shovel out, do some shovel work, and blow off all the grass clippings and make it look beautiful. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make this yard look beautiful. This is a nice neighborhood. The sign right here says for sale. Knock on the door, see if anyone lives here. Dang, this one's gonna look really good after it's mowed, so go ahead and do it, baby. Those guys on YouTube and stuff. Oh yeah, clean up videos. Yep. And they're like, they, they, then they, they, uh, what do they call it? They uh, um, do that slow caption where then they speed it up and they yeah. go. Yeah, yeah. And that's, then what, like, that's what I'm doing here. Five minutes, it's, it's all done. Yep. Um, we gotta get in this driveway right. Oh, here. right here. Yeah. Okay. All right, I'll, I'll pull up. He yeah. Do you right mind? There, so, so. Yeah. I, but yeah, I'll pull up. No yeah. Problem. If you don't mind, that'd be great. Yeah. We're gonna tear out the kitchen. We'll be a couple of hours. Oh and, no no. I'll, I'll just pull up where he was. Oh okay cool. Yeah. Thank you. Yep. No problem. All right. Yep. Have a good one. You too. I'm not sure. Jeez. You need like a snow plow to go through that thing. Yeah. <laughs> now I got my, my Toro. That ain't too bad. This is nothing. Shit. Nothing compared to what I usually do. I tried cutting it first and then we whack. Oh, yeah. Well, I do the videos. I do videos and it's like satisfying for people to watch. So I do it all backwards. <laughs>
Got to change batteries.
right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. I think this property turned out great. Definitely one of my best properties that I've ever done. The finished product looked beautiful. As I was leaving, the neighbor across the street said it looked a heck of a lot better. And he also said he was glad that I got rid of the eyesore. The house was for sale, and he told me he don't know how they're gonna sell the house with the grass being so out of control and crazy. They don't gotta worry about that now. We gave them a free yard makeover. They'll be surprised when they pull up to that yard and it's cut and looking beautiful. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys, and if you guys live in Florida, please be safe for the hurricane that's coming. They say it's gonna be a crazy one. We're gonna be prepared here. Make sure you guys are prepared. So yeah, I love you guys, and we'll see you next week.